What is good everybody? Welcome back to another My Damn Toys video. Today we have some more WWE Elite action figure news for you guys and it is about some upcoming action figures coming up at San Diego Comic Con guys. As you can see on the screen, the first one is Rey Mysterio. Yes, Rey Mysterio in his, I think it's the Greatest Royal Rumble, wasn't it? Or was it the uh, was it the regular Royal Rumble? I think it was the Greatest Royal Rumble. It's the second appearance he had in the green, you know, shirt with the white accents with the sleeveless t-shirt. This was shown on Instagram by Showcase underscore Collector and he always is up to date on the stuff. He called Kurt Angle. He called, I don't know if he is in touch with Mattel. I don't know if he works for him. I don't know what the deal is on that, but he did announce this on his Instagram and he's usually pretty accurate about what is going to be released and he put this up this Rey Mysterio here I have a custom shown here this is not the exact attire but this is sort of what we're going to get I don't know if this is supposed to be Elite Series 69 you know because you know Elite Series 69 does have a Rey Mysterio in it and I don't know if that's going to be his return attire in the Royal Rumble 2018 or if it's going to be the greatest Royal Rumble attire like this and this is the figure that he's showing off here but he says that it will be at San Diego Comic Con here in the green and white and I'm so excited excited for it because We've been wanting an updated Rey Mysterio figure, and every one that we have gotten since he's returned has been WCW, even with basics. We haven't gotten a current day Rey Mysterio just yet, so this will be a really nice addition to the collection. I'm happy to see this. I think they're going to knock it out of the park, especially with the true effects and the nice mask sculpts they can do now. I think that they will totally kill this, and I cannot wait for it. I think it's going to be absolutely incredible, so I am excited for this one. Hopefully, um, Elite Series 69 and this one are different. Hopefully, we see Elite Series 69 as the main return Rey Mysterio, and then the one we see at San Diego Comic-Con will be the one showcased here. So we get two different Rey Mysterios. I think that'd be cool. This one, of course, does come with a shirt. The the uh, the attire that you're seeing here in this picture, I'm pretty sure there's there's a shirt with it. And the one that he wore at the uh, Royal Rumble that you know he returned in the first place, it was shirtless. So hopefully we get both versions. That way we'll have a t-shirt version and a non-t-shirt version. And he says it will come with this sleeveless Rey Mysterio t-shirt anyway. So I'm happy with that. I'm all for cloth accessories and stuff of that nature. So this is a big get here. And then the second figure that we're taking a look, guys, is... The Elite NXT TakeOver London Finn Balor. Here is a custom on the screen, as you can see as well. And this is a custom made by Brocklock Customs. And he is such a great customizer. This is what the figure will look like when it's mass-produced by Mattel. However... Hopefully they don't give us this small AF torso, guys. You know how I feel about the torsos and the Finn Balor, guys. I cannot stand it. Um, I do not like when they give us the crappy, small Daniel Bryan torso. And if it is the small, crappy Daniel Bryan torso, then I, I really don't even want the figure. Like So if, if they do that, I'm going to be highly disappointed. I just can't get over it. It's a really big pet peeve, especially since Finn Balor is one of my you know favorite wrestlers. I think that it's really crappy when they give us that small body. So hopefully you know we get it the way the network spotlight was. We get it the way the entrance greats was and um, they continue that trend of giving us the good Finn Balor torso and the ripped up torso that Cody Rhodes slash Seth Rollins torso that you know Mattel gives us every every once in a while but we have gotten some you know we've gotten more Daniel Bryan mold uh, demon Finn Balors over uh, regular so or the way they should be so you know sometimes you have to just uh, you know just freaking cling to hope and hope that they give us the right one but uh uh, that is the next one, NXT TakeOver London. Very nice attire. I love it. You can see the paint there. It looks fantastic. It looks great. And the teeth design even looks great on the front. I think this is going to be... If he ends up rocking this one, like if we end up getting the right torso, guys, ooh, buddy, I'm going to absolutely cream my pants, I think. But it looks fantastic. I'm excited for it. Hopefully, that's what we get. And it looks like it is going to come with the entrance gear, the hat, the jacket, the all that jazz. But um, I'm super excited for this. I'm definitely more excited for this over the Rey Mysterio. I love Rey Mysterio, but no, nothing's got nothing on my boy Finn Balor. I think that this is going to be a really epic release. And it's going to be an early figure contender of the year, uh, figure of the year contender if we get this exact, you know, figure with the with the right body mold and it has all the accessories, checks all the boxes, it will be really epic. I can't wait for it. But um, Comic-Con, dude, Comic-Con's going to be absolutely fantastic. Like, who, who is hyped for Comic-Con? Uh, what I want to know down in the comment section below, guys, I really, I want to do a video on that. Um, I think it'd be a really good video idea is if I did, you know, what figures do you want to see or the figures that I want to see the most from uh, Comic-Con from Mattel. I think that would be a really good video idea. Maybe I can do that this week or something. But um, that is all the WWE action figure news I have for you guys. I saw somebody post some Elite Series 71. I think Drew McIntyre is going to be in Elite Series 71. We already knew that. And then I think Adam Cole is going to be in that series with an, a North American Championship. The first time we're getting a North American Championship, you know it's going to be the uh, the, the screaming head scan. I think uh, it's the series after the Johnny Gargano and 
stuff. It's that one that we saw at that one uh, at that one con. I think it was WrestleMania Access. But I'm excited for that whole series. Whatever they put in Elite Series 71, I cannot remember who posted it on Instagram. I wanted to add it to the video, but I couldn't remember. And they don't even they don't even show you your liked photos on Instagram no more. I looked forever, couldn't find it. But anyways, that is going to do it for all of the figure news I have for you guys. We have the Rey Mysterio release, and we have the NXT TakeOver London Finn Balor figure that looks so epic. I cannot wait for it. I think it's one of the best uh, demon face paints he's ever done. So I'm, I'm very, very excited for that one. You guys already know that. But I'm also excited for Elite Series 71 with the Drew McIntyre and the Adam Cole with the North American title, baby. That's going to be freaking sweet, nasty farticles. But I would love to know what figures you hope to see at San Diego Comic-Con this year. San Diego Comic-Con is in the middle of July. It is going to be absolutely great. I think Mattel is going to bring the heat like they always do. And every year, it seems like they get better and better. So I'm super happy for it, super excited for these figures. And I'm also interested to know, is this the Demon Finn Balor that was going to be in the NXT Series 5? Or is this a new, different Demon Finn Balor? that we're getting here in the main Elite line. Or is this Elite Series 70? This could be Elite Series 70, Finn Balor, right? Because that was announced for Elite 70. We covered it in a video. Um, this could be the Elite 70, but who knows? We'll have to find out when Comic-Con gets here and everything. But thank you guys for watching. Subscribe to the channel for more epic WWE figure videos. Follow me on Instagram and Twitter at MyDamnToys, and I will see you guys in the next video. Thank you.